And looks like the yeah, the lanes are set. We all have a Trillion versus Trillion bottom here. Uh I don't think I've seen Maki King in this kind of situation before. I feel like if he gets caught out, if they catch a glimpse of where he's actually at, he's jumping on to the Ursa right now. The first fight will already break out a big shadow wave! Actually bringing the Ursa so, so low. One more Rectic boot to the chick, and there it is. Faith actually gets it. And Kaka... Oh, they well, can't even get the, dropping they low, can't but they can't finish him off. Yeah, he just salve up, jumps up to an extra tree. <laughs> the tree was killed by, by Ward. So he will still end up falling, maybe? That is... Yeah, not reaching up against that Thunderstrike, but <laughs> that was interesting to see. He just, he's gotten a good start, so at some point he can rotate into the jungle, finish up his, his items there. As it stands down bottom, we see another fight, the Primal Spring coming through. Only a slow on one, I believe, to stun on to Maki King. Oh Big Shadow Wave again, just so much damage coming through from that. And now, an extra slow from uh, that Poison Touch, and this time around, the bear will fall. Can't dive the tower. So Monkey King has literally no armor. He can almost negate with the bottle and the healing ward. He even went for soul ring. <laughs> Alright. Oh no no, oh no. God damn it. I was looking at the Tinker while like, yeah. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was really surprised for a second, what the hell? Yeah, the, those are no but, Juggernaut uh, items. Nah. Uh, but yeah, so Juggernaut in that sense. Oh, oh lane. Tinker. Kaka was so sitting around here for a while. Is it? Is this ah, he's enough? coming in, yes, the Omni Slash, one, two, three. Alright. That was enough. That's all you need. You have no faith, Skim. That's a problem. I really have no faith. He taps next assassin. I don't know exactly what's going on. KP. No stampede actually. No mana for storm, so it's a good opening. But bundle striking absolutely everyone. U9 comes through. He glimpses back here, but the damage comes oh from God. faith instead. Double kill with a single shadow wave. Are you freaking kidding me? Not even done yet here. Another primal spring. We'll slow down at the next assassin. Stampede coming off cooldown here, gets him closer, a couple of right clicks, should secure it now. Ah, Spike Carapace, nicely tied. He has but... another uh, on the strike. What a hero. What a hero indeed. Yeah, I think, I wanted to say that uh, the Disruptor needs to kick boards. On your course even, Ursa. Oh, oh, He's oh, on your course struggling even. so hard. He's... Sometimes you see Ursa's already with making it like a Helm of the Dominator, you can, so you can start going into Roshan. But he's nowhere near that. Omni Slash killed on bottom at the same time. Struggling for now it's Kaka as well as KP. I'm actually farming up the dire side jungle and pushing mid, and uh, the fight oh, why, actually why breaks out. Wukong's command coming through. They do get one kill on the Disruptor RP now. On to the Monkey King, that'll also take care of the ultimate. Spectre Horns in, actually tracks down a Tinker, he's dead. Everyone else started to drop kind of low, newbie. Or oh, used all the spells though, so it might be that they can make their way out of their face boots. Another dagger, yeah, alright, that should be enough. <laughs> he's go, trying to go for the courier, so just randomly flies by, we can't get off more than one right click. Dear Dragon Drop, do you remember what I said two minutes ago? When I said they need the Blink Dagger on the Magnus, they need yeah. the VATs on the Tinker, and I hope they disengage from any fight until that happens. Yeah. Great, they traded two cores for a support <laughs> Monkey King. Yay. I don't know what they were thinking. They were in a really bad position to fight, to take that fight. Um, they didn't They didn't know the Monkey King was God. Oh, God. Hey, let me just walk up on Omni Slash you. What a free kill, and now Ozzy Age, he does have a spike carry pace, but SEC can just spin nope. him down. He's dead. G to the G, almost, at least for these two heroes in this particular instance. Meanwhile, they really need to find a good one. They need that plus a damage output from an empowered Ursa, plus they don't a have... Tinker. Oh no. And right they now they see it. everything that's going on. Blink stump from KP, he sets this up perfectly for the Wukong's command. Tinker is dead already, S triple C. He's just only slashing in a bag, just getting an extra free kill. The skew in, in back into the uh, Monkey King ult. And somehow, Ursa TP's out of that one. That was just a Dota God hey. smiling upon him. That's that's all it was. You know. Well, that's even particularly good this game. I will say that the. Nah, it's just. It's just. It's uh, just I think it's just yeah. a fun build. <laughs> yeah. Just the idea of walking up in this and into an, an Omni Slash out of nowhere. Yeah, T2 or whatever, top lane also dies. 
Yeah, it's good that you didn't, didn't go there. Yeah, FPS it's... jobs galore. Yeah. Oh, they find the monkey thing, maybe. Yeah. Oh wow. First kill in the wild for FTDC. Yeah. That's... And Tinker has the blink dagger now. So with the blink dagger. Other than that, just a damage reduction. But, I, I mean, mean, I guess it's good stats with the ultimate orb. Yeah, I mean, generally, there we go. He just walks in. Yes, well, I mean, oh, yeah, the damage reduction is obviously nice, but. Yeah, he's so dead right now, actually. Oh, maybe not. Nice little stun nab into the static so They can maybe turn us around and still lose the Ursa. And I think there's nowhere to be seen. Only now coming in, starting to throw down some marches and spells. But with the healing ward going, they don't even really need to care about the single march. <laughs> the Nyx Assassin blinked in, killed the... Oh my god. Uh, killed, the, killed the ward and then disappeared. Yep. Another book comes command, FPS drops galore, couple of frame drops to... Uh, we can handle it, U9... Uh, actually in a bit of a pickle right now. <laughs> Abandoned by the rest of the team inside the die base, he will die and that's a big kill. Now Ursa's looking for more glimpse back on Kaka, only has a couple of fewer swipes on top of him. Need a few more to bring him down and there it is. They're looking for more faith in the side and missed the stun, but they should be able to catch up with him. Eventually, there it is, double kill. Hey. They killed the Spectre. Yeah. That was, uh, that was nice. That's, That's uh... Them. Oh, this is a really good movement from Nubi. I wonder if they have any vision of this. No, disrupt the TPs out. They will oh. find the Magnus. What? He, someone gets a TP out before the Raiders can, can come into effect. A blink can blink out an NTP. They so will they find only the get a Nyx Nyx Assassin. Assassin. It's almost okay. Yeah. If, if you only lose a Nyx Assassin. Definitely on point for Nubi. I wonder what newbie is waiting for. Oh, stun maybe, maybe is missed, master? and now they have to run. Stampede comes through, though. Glimpse back on one, but the rest of them are more than enough to bring him down. Omni Slash just before Ursa can get his ultimate. Oh, that was just a battle strike set up for a double kill for Estimal C. That they have, is, to have to have a creep uh, mid if they want to use that one. Quite... Tinker will take care of it. I mean, <laughs> it's just. Yeah, you could. Oh, nice skewer. Oh, but it's a centaur. <laughs> the glimpse back, oh, short range. The glimpse. Yeah, it's it's a centaur. If you find anybody else, that might be great. But it's a centaur. He has a freaking heart. Yep. Twenty-eight minutes and heart vanguard. You you're not going to kill him. Three point five k health him. points. The more time you spend trying and... to, the more time the rest newbie has to just chip away down at the bottom. And yeah. Healing Water Song, that one's up, Blink oh, Stump, no, actually, in. it's a good setup here, gonna bring down and stop the first, no stacks on this fight. Ursa with the ultimate, they will dodge some of that damage, but now, the Wukong's command, killing my FPS. But it looks like Newby will just be able to roll over FTDC now. Ah, it's GG. They're gonna take this set of racks and the other ones as well, Stain. P now on two, so nicely done, some good damage being done overall, but... Ultimately not enough, even you nine, oh. uh... Does not get caught by this. That could have been such a cute play if they had trapped the Spectre there. <laughs> um, meanwhile, Astro will see. The objective based game, he has a spin to dodge a rocket spam. Not even gonna get yeah, the still, second still Rex for now. Still has the Aegis, but they should just give him mana somehow and then wait for the healing ward. KP is like, why don't Rex attack? I wanna use my return on these. Look, look how U9 is just following SCCC. He literally just waiting for the healing ward. <laughs> Looking at KP right now is just having some fun tanking up everything that FTD has to offer. Oh, there it is, healing ward. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, that's, oh, that's actually nice. sad. That's actually sad that this Tinker is not. Like, he can win against healing ward. He just can't. Yeah. Faith will also give himself up. Meanwhile, top though, Shakespeare's space created. Faith? He got the kill against. He got the kill. What? Oh god, I wasn't even looking at that. What? Okay. I guess this is how you know. He that didn't have faith in faith. <laughs> yeah, he did not. I'm sorry. We were talking about this earlier, weren't we? Yep. Uh, this was a. This was a demonstration. I think. FTD is just getting outclassed here. In all departments, really, you can you can tell you can tell like little glimpses of you know what FTD is cap FTDC is capable of, and that there are a team that is, you know, I mean, they they there's a reason why they're in this league, right? They earned their place here.
uh, at some stage. So you can see why I think their draft and their draft wasn't even that bad. And uh, honestly, it's just that they really, I mean, newbie is just the Nyx assassin. Uh, yeah, I don't even hate this too much. I don't, I'm not sure how much kill potential newbie actually has in the beginning. Uh, with just because they do have the devil behind him. Uh, they as I control. say that, actually, they might just kill him. Yeah, they might just kill him. Uh, I was just joking, guys. Yeah. <laughs> if, by a lot of control, I mean they have way too much control. They have so much control. Especially if you consider that some of the creeps that he denies are um, via his his idolons, right? The demonic conversion. Double stun, but they still get the follow up there on Dazzle. No shovel grave just yet. Still on level one, so. Get themselves an extra kill here. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And then Meepo. Yeah, Meepo. Um, and Disruptor <laughs> hasn't really Meepo. been. Disruptor hasn't really effectively pulled and stacked as you would like. Look at this, he pulled half the creep wave now for, for some reason. Yeah. It's something that I do on a regular basis, but then again, I'm also a 3k scrub. <laughs> so. But I, I still think that the laning stage isn't as bad as, as it could have been for FT, FTDC. Um, the Dazzle is now getting free. But yeah. Are they trying to uh, look for a kill here? Yeah, they're looking nine, for a kill here. They only use the stun there from the assassin, but they do get the glimpse back right on the tower. Throws down a, uh, a storm hammer. There's too much nice. damage and not enough. Nice. On the side of the Sven, so good catch there for sure. Who is all by himself and he... Look, also if you faith look at up the top. map right now, how does he not realize that he's being ganked? I don't know. Oh. I get spin off into the oh, TP. Nice. If, actually, he's nothing out. to cancel it. Nope. Oh, oh no. man, never mind! The long range crackle! <laughs> Just on the edge! so close. Oh, God. Barely get that kill. Meanwhile, Faith up top, he also ends up surviving up against four heroes. Now, Glimpse back. United's also there, pops his own ultimate, gets a sudden kinetic field, has a stun to throw, whatever. And. It's a good disengage so far. It's a good disengage. The ah, the vision. Disengage. Vision actually saved uh, the Nick Sassan FO mode, but now Kake gets close enough for the crash. Yeah, he will end okay. up. That's okay. You lose one. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> uh, but yeah, well, the Juggernaut, if you look at the map, nobody was mid farming. Creeps are worth 90, they're worth twice what one melee creep is worth. Glimpse back on Slada, follow up stun, nicely done here, and they should actually be able to burst him down, maybe, maybe not. He actually comes back in, goes for the crush on oh, one, oh, that's still coming through. Almost bring down Faith and Kaipi in the side, and in fact, Faith dies to the disruptor, but now Astro will say, has something to say about the rest of his fight. Nice stun again from the next, though. I realize he's not playing against Monkey King anymore. <laughs> maybe some, uh, oh god, what's going on here? Juggernaut spinning as he finds quite a few heroes to crush, just slightly missed time. Nice little Stag Storm actually bringing down Faye, but Astro is sitting on the edge of it. Go for one for one support traits, short range glimpse here, let's array just for some extra space. I'll keep him safe, but now the rest of the newbie coming in. KP does have a black hole here, can't get it off a pretty good one if he just waits out the spike carapace, and there it is. Maybe a little bit smaller than it looked like because of all the Meepos being caught up in it, but. Damage has been done. Nicely connected oh, to the oh, oh, oh. <laughs> tower! One, two, no, tower. that's enough! The okay, tower no. finishes up one, and the meanwhile, the back disruptor being brought down by I another believe storm. I that was a 4 hammer. zero trade. Ah, uh, something along those lines. Uh, four, Faith four, ended up wait. dying. Oh, the game bugged out. What happened to our smoke? <laughs> Kaka will reveal himself now. Can get glimpse back, though. Might not have been the best decision. Just He's TP's. So cocky. <laughs> oh my god. So cocky, but uh, <laughs> I mean, I can't blame him. I can't blame him at that. What's it? I think they could almost afford afford that. It's just that the heroes that they need to be farmed aren't like the the the, the, the next assassin. He has nothing. They need the next assassin to be farmed. I'm going to try and catch Astro C and with a nice little static storm follow us there from uh, the Juggernaut and the glimpse back. They will get that kill. Now U9 is there to contend with. He can throw the stun. Kaka is there, starting at first. Couple of right clicks here in the amplify and keeping it going here. Faith. Couple of spells to throw, but U9 with a glimpse back. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Sherlock Grave use. Kaka can go for the crush. No, why doesn't he crush there? Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why he didn't crush there. No, he's still sprinting. He's still looking for it, but he gets stunned up. No shrines. So 
This drop that can't be healed, but there's plenty of control there to bring Kaka down again. Alright, now it's starting to be Kaka. Oh, yes. <laughs> A lot of control, so it's... And then of course you have the Lina mid, who is naturally rather fast. Oh, bottom lane, Meepo. Yeah. Was a Meepo there, this... I'm pretty sure. This is, uh, this comes down to, in my opinion, Quetzal is in no fly zone, basically. Fly isn't even playing in China, dude. Actually, he is in China right now because of DAC. Oh, wow. So, check me. Damn it. <laughs> but it's not in this game, that's my point. These kind of movements, I mean, I can understand maybe being a All bit faith. apprehensive about going for tier 2s. There's so. a glimpse, Faith. You would. Oh, uh, there's a glimpse. Good. And he is dead. This, of course, doesn't help, right? If you, if you keep putting yourselves in situations like this, we're just. Hey. Could have gone for the other slash. Do they have yeah. <laughs> no. oh, they yes, do have they do. And the static storm has to be seeing a lot of trouble right now, actually, and he will have to deny himself. Yeah, you and I has to take over to try and get revenge, and he will follow up blink, oh, blink crush rush. onto two more kills for you nine. So there it is, Kaipi trying to go for the Malefice, but looks of it. It's right, looks like up by nine has had but yeah, he's, he's still dead. He's an angry, angry little guy. Uh, it's a good trade. They didn't even think newbies. Just like, all right, guys, we need to take this game seriously for because they technically can still win. Uh, smoke breaks, blink, oh, crush wow. to the high ground here with no vision, I oh, believe. Never mind, they have a, no, they have. Oh, never, they have oh, yeah, just, never mind then. But not as impressive, but still, they're gonna get one kill and perhaps a little bit more. They're definitely looking for Kaka with another blink available right now. Not so much as it's been cancelled, but U9, not so much. Shellgrave comes out on. Juggernauts, uh, they didn't even focus on him. I couldn't see the ward because of the hero. Okay. Yeah, only slash dies, only slash into an easy kill. So they get something in return. Yeah. I, I couldn't see the. Should end up dying to this. Maybe, maybe not. Stick charges actually keep him alive. Now, S triple C with some Shadow Grave. Shadow Grave. Uh, Shadow Blade. <laughs> Shadow Grave comes out, steady some just a zone. But spells are still being used. And Juggernaut will still die despite the healing ward being dropped down. Last serve, uh, the disruptor. You. U9 looking to start to link up with them perhaps so they can go high ground if they really want to. Instead he can just go for some kills. Link, stun, and those spike capers, one, two, three, godlike spree. <laughs> and uh, now look for Meepo here. Don't think he's got the memo, there it is. It feels like he could get more out of this. Yeah. Oh they see the they see Faith. Yeah. Observer, Sentry Road Combat, I see Faith as well as Astrable C up on the high ground. So Faith, not quite dying to right click. See, and the blink crush. crush on three heroes. Follow up is not quite there. He only starts bouncing through inside the static storm. Melina will actually die as Meepo moves in. And now when U9 has to go for the man fight. Not doing a ridiculous amount of damage here without his ultimate, but there's still gonna be enough as Astrable C comes back with the Aegis. And now Newbie just looking to clean house a little bit more. Thank a little bit later. I think, yeah, I, I agree. I think that's the play here. Uh, glimpse in mid here. Kaka gets brought back. A hex actually on a high ground onto the Rubik. And Meepo's finishing that one off first. Means Kaka can stay yeah, alive. Oh, U9 comes through. Slowed down a little bit by the kinetic field, but a crush catches nice one. Brave. Shallow Grave keeping him alive. So far, so good. Now to poof out. Still alive, but U9 gets close enough to finish him off anyway. Meanwhile, S Triple C. And the no rest of newbies people. just killing them all. Only one buyback, that's some juggernaut. Like, yeah. That might as well be GG. Yeah, I'm not even sure. Again, newbie just outclasses them. They didn't even use uh, Black Hole in that game. No, nope. he's gonna use it uh, now. In that sure. gank. Pretty yeah, sure he's gonna use it now. Probably. <laughs> he wants to use it. He wants to use it so badly. I know you, Kaipi. Come, come on, just use it. There it yeah, is. There it is. Inside the fountain. He's still gonna die. <laughs> But they get two more kills, and maybe a third one if they want to dive high ground again, but yeah, it's just playing a little bit around a little bit at this point. To say, uh, that's such a hassle to go all the way up to the tier 2, finish that one off. So I'd rather do it for some extra kills, but Hex comes through on top of the Omni Slash, so U9 taking a bit of damage, but now it's on PKB. 1, 2, 3, 4, Shallow Grave keeps him safe, but Dazzle not so much. He's caught on the steps. Oh, <laughs> I like how the Juggernaut just knew that he was going to do that as well. <laughs> and in the meantime, Meepo dies for the second time. Oh, you're <laughs> mine. 
And Kaka, he's hilarious. gonna lose the gem here, but nothing, nothing that matters. Oh, Dust actually catches Astro Plus. He was still super fast. You know, the funny thing is, if Meepo hadn't died here and if they had sweeped Newbie here, they could technically they could technically have held on to this game because it's not like they like... can do something. But they're still trying, so kudos to them. Right, they're not giving up. They're still smoking. Oh, they're trying to find something That's such in the top. Easy kill as well. Well, mind you, they pick the Meepo into the Lena. Yeah, GG's called. Yep. Yeah. Get a couple of sub kills on separate places across the map. Without a single victory or without a single point in DPL season three. Also showing his last couple of kills because frankly that's not safe for work anymore. It really isn't. <laughs> and if you look at if you look at the opponents that FT 